Welcome back, everybody. All right. So what happens if you want to do uh, more than one style point? Um, well, there's a couple things that we have to do. Uh, the thing is, is that let's just take a look at this header one here and let's go ahead and let's um, add in something. Let's change the font. So what we'll do is we'll type in a semicolon. Now, technically, all of these need a semicolon here and you can go ahead and put those in if you want to. If you're only doing one, you don't technically need one, but if you're doing more than one, you do need one. And uh, it's best that you use uh, a semicolon and maybe just get in the habit of putting it in there anyway. The semicolon is a really important character in computer programming. And the reason why is that usually a semicolon tells you that the computer's done reading that line. So in most other programming languages, and keep in mind that there was a lot of programming languages before HTML, and HTML has built upon those uh, programming languages. So in most programming languages, you'd have something that says, you know, output to screen, semicolon, next line, um, and do the code and whatever. And that's essentially where this comes from. So again, if we have the semicolon here, you can just type in another property here. So you can type in font, family, Okay, we're going to type in colon, and um, we can just type in courier, because I love that font. It's kind of cool, just like that, and you can see it instantly changes. And we can do this all day if we want to. So watch this. We can go to uh, background color, and we can go black. Okay, and there you go. You can see the background colors there. Now, there's one other thing that you, you'd probably like to do. The other one is text align, all right? just like this and uh, you can say center just like that and you can see that the text line is center you can also type in right okay and just because uh, for this video for the video tutorial purposes I'm not going to resize the window but if you resize the window you'll see that the uh, the output will uh, form to the window here okay and uh, if it does form to the window uh, that's that's actually kind of cool in the way that it does that. And, and if we were to do this in another programming language, uh, what would end up happening is uh, there'd be a lot of code just to do that. In fact, you know, when I've made games for Xbox 360, doing that was actually quite a bit of a challenge. All right, so you can add in more than one style point here. Uh, in another uh, course is d dealt with CSS, where what it does is it takes all these style points and puts it in a different document. All right, so what we're doing is we're doing the style points of CSS right in the HTML. But that's fine. I'm going to show you some more cool stuff in HTML. I'll see you guys in the next tutorial.